there's a time uh, window that's pretty tight. So you want to get that started within, well, as soon as possible, but no longer than 72 hours. PEP, or post-exposure prophylaxis, is a drug that some describe as a morning after pill for HIV exposure. However, it can have severe side effects and must be prescribed by a doctor. That it's a 28-day regimen, so, so it's a significant uh, commitment. It can be um, difficult to get through that 28 days. Uh, that's usually when somebody would have side effects. According to Dr. Paul Scholz, an epidemiologist with Norton Healthcare, the drug usually requires a doctor's oversight, which is why it's unlikely to ever be available over the counter. You're, you're going to have to rely on a primary care doctor or potentially an immediate care center or an emergency department. Most of the time, I would advise people if you think that you have a prep or I'm sorry, a PEP situation post-exposure prophylaxis for HIV, that's really an emergency department thing because it needs to happen quickly and you need to know for sure that they can do it for you. The drug is most effective if started within the first two hours of exposure, which is why Dr. Scholz recommends those who may need it go to an emergency room. But for those who engage in high-risk sexual behavior, Scholz recommends the drug PrEP, or pre-exposure prophylaxis. Access uh, has been proved a lot to these medications so that the average person, if they if they come in here today and they are high risk, most likely we're going to succeed in getting them on treatment. Carrie Grace, WLKY News.